pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, for liberty and justice for all. Hi, CW Henry, class of 2020. I'm going to introduce the next person you're going to hear sing. His name is Eric Anderson, and he is a 2005 graduate of Henry. He is currently in the United States Air Force and also pursuing a law degree to study in the music industry. I'm so proud of him and all of his accomplishments, and I hope that you enjoy his beautiful voice as much as I have over the past 17 years. Thank you, Eric, for doing this for us, and enjoy C.W. Henry, class of 2020. Lift every voice and sing Till earth and heaven ring Ring with the harmonies of liberty let our rejoicing rise high as the listening skies. Let it resound loud as the rolling sea. Sing a song full of the faith that the dark past has taught us. Sing a song full of the hope that the present has brought us. Facing the rising sun of our new day begun. Let us march on till victory is won. Welcome to the Charles W. Henry Class of 2020 Move Up Day Ceremony. My name is Kate Davis and I'm the proud principal of the CW Henry School. Parents and families, I wanna begin by thanking you for your support during your child's educational journey. Whether you've been a CW Henry parent for many years or joined our parent community more recently, please know that we deeply value and appreciate your partnership. Students, here we are. Today is the day and this is the moment that you've all been waiting for. This year, and especially these past few months, we've had an experience that none of us could have ever predicted. More than anything, I wish that we could be together today in person, celebrating you as you move on from eighth grade and into high school. Please know that the faces and the voices of the class of 2020 can never be forgotten at Henry. While this is goodbye for now, we hope it's not goodbye forever. I wanna thank you for your strength during these challenging times and commend your ability to continue working towards always achieving your goals. Please join me in congratulating the Charles W. Henry graduating class of 2020. The class of 2020 will be attending many prestigious high schools across the city and beyond. 
I am proud to announce the following students who are continuing their education at Saul High School. Katina Dorsey, Jade Ebener Yacker, Feruza Hyman, Ari Showell, and Joshua Weaver. Girls High is proud to receive April Augustine, Amara Chiaka, Alea Crawford, and Nicole Gordon. Venturing off to Lankano High School are Jocelyn Hayes and Courtney Scott. Furthering their studies at Roxborough High School are Majir DeBrady, Faith Fields, Najee Jerkins, Jeru Anthony, and Tommy Coyle. Attending Building 21 is Amira Jubilee. Moving on to Parkway Northwest are Jaden Fuller, Janai Jones, Azalea Melton Kelly, Jimmy Scott, Scott Seward, Sinai Warlaw, Georgia Webb, and myself, Chloe Coleman Palmer. Furthering his studies at George Washington Carver High School of Engineering and Science is Asad Hobson. Attending Constitution High School is Sincere Northern. Moving on to Parkway Center City Middle College are Morgan Gordy, Kyla Hall, Sydney Jowers, and Anaya Lewis. Venturing off to Science Leadership Academy Beaver Campus are Jeremy Hayes and Olivia Williams. Furthering their education at Randolph Career and Technical High School are Trayvon Barr, Guy Baxterville, Cassius Childs, Anthony Emerson, Joshua Green, Aaron Skates, and Elijah Stevenson. Heading to Kappa is Majira Fleming. Moving on to Dobbins High School are Canyon Duckery and Cameron Duckery. Franklin Learning Center is proud to receive Morgan Jones. Moving, to, moving on to the study at Science Leadership Academy is Langston Payne. Attending Crystal Ray High School are Kylie Carter and myself in the Vale Woodards. Venturing off to Little Flower High School is Deani Massey. Congrats and good luck in high school class of 2020. Hello, I'm Mr. Brogan, the school counselor here at CW Henry Elementary School. I'm honored to have been asked to participate in the virtual move up day ceremony for our eighth graders. Uh, today I have the privilege of recognizing 11 special students who have attended CW Henry since kindergarten. We lovingly refer to these folks as our lifers. And this year, that includes 11 students. So please, let's give an extra congratulations to Cassius Childs, Chloe Coleman Palmer, Alea Crawford, Jade Ebner Yacker, Ruza Hyman, Janai Jones, Sydney Jowers, Anaya Lewis, Scott Seward, Sanaya Wardlaw, and Olivia Williams. Congratulations to you 11 for sticking with CW Henry for your entire elementary and middle school career. And congratulations to all members of the eighth grade class. Best of luck in the fall and please stay in touch. We're always here to help you and support you. Go Hawks. Hello, my name is Jennifer Gethin and I am the seventh and eighth grade learning support teacher. The following students have exemplified citizenship throughout their eighth grade year by demonstrating the qualities of respect, responsibility, and achievement. Congratulations to the recipients of our Citizenship Award. Kylie Carter, Amira Chiaka, Katina Dorsey, Nicole Gordon, Joshua Green, Jeremy Hayes, Tymee Coyle, Morgan Jones, Sydney Jowers, Langston Payne, Aaron Skates, Jameer Scott, Sanaya Wardlaw, Alea Crawford, Jade Abner Yacker, Majir Fleming, Jaden Fuller, Morgan Gordy, Kyla Hall, Jocelyn Hayes, Feruza Hyman, Janai Jones, Anaja Lewis, Dayani Massey, Courtney Scott, Aries Showell, Georgia Webb, and Olivia Williams. Congratulations. Hello again. I am proud to give the Role Model Citizen Award. Although each of the students exhibited the characteristics of a student citizen, two young women stood out to the faculty as model citizens. These young women could always be counted to do the right thing, to try their best, and to lend a hand, helping hand. Every day, these young ladies were role models for their peers at Henry. Please join me in recognizing Nicole Gordon and Amara Shiaka. Congratulations, ladies. Hi, eighth graders. Um, it's 
sucks that we're in this position, but at least you'll have us forever on your phones and computers. Um, I hope you had a great time with us while you were there. And if you were with me for more than just this year, I will miss you so much. And if you were with me for only a couple months this year, I'm glad to have met you. And to all the families of the amazing children, um, thank you for your support over the years. And if you were in the musical or the choir, I appreciate your love and energy towards the program. And I hope that you continue to make music in the future. Um, so I'm presenting a few awards. The first is for your talent and dedication to the Aladdin musical this year. So I'm going to give this award to Janai Jones, Morgan Jones, Morgan Gordy, Alaya Crawford, Olivia Williams, Myjer Fleming, Kyla Hall, Anaya Lewis, Georgia Webb, Diani Massey, and Chloe Coleman Palmer. I'd also like to give two awards to two students that have been in my choir for many, many years, and I will miss them. And this is Feruza Hyman and Katina Dorsey. Thank you so much, and I wish you the best of luck. Thank you to the leaders of C.W. Henry's Student Council, Dayani Macy and Sydney Jowers. Thanks for all you do to make our school great. Mrs. Smith and Mrs. Raub would like to thank all of the following students who contributed to the class yearbook this year. Morgan Jones, Morgan Gordy, Alea Crawford, Kyla Hall, Anaya Lewis, Dayani Macy, Nicole Gordon, Chloe Coleman Palmer, Sydney Jowers, Sanaya Wardlaw, and Kylie Carter. Thanks so much. We would like to recognize the following eighth graders who participated in the Reading Olympics this year. Alea Crawford, and Feruza Hyman. Hi, my name is Jared Jacobs, and I am the 6th and 7th grade math teacher at Henry. I would like to offer the following awards for students in track and field. Our 2020 track and field team included the following. Alea Crawford, Kylie Carter, Anaya Lewis, Feruza Hyman, Langston Payne, Katina Dorsey, and Asad Hobson. Congratulations to those students in track and field. In addition, Ms. Canarini and I led our volleyball team through an amazing season last fall. Congratulations to the following players. April Augustine, Alea Crawford, Morgan Gordy, Kyla Hall, Jocelyn Hayes, Chloe Coleman Palmer, Sanaya Wardlaw, and Olivia Williams. Congratulations to our volleyball players. Hi students, it's Ms. Canarini. Just wanted to say congratulations and way to go making it through your all your years at Henry. Whether you were here from kindergarten or just joined us last year, 2020 has been quite an end to your endeavors here at Henry. And we congratulate you, I congratulate you, and I wish you well. And I know that you're gonna be the leaders that we need you to be in the future. I've had the privilege of coaching the CW Henry softball team for nearly 12 years now. And this year I have to say, my biggest Henry heartbreak of the COVID pandemic was losing our softball season. My girls practiced for weeks before our season was abruptly cut short. These young women worked together for three years, many of them, to become the strongest, most cooperative, skillful team I have ever had the privilege of coaching. Girls, I know you would have won the championship, and in my heart, you already did. Get back out on the field in high school and show them how to do it. Congratulations to our 2020 softball team who included the following young women. Chloe Coleman Palmer, Alea Crawford, Morgan Gordy, Kyla Hall, Jocelyn Hayes, Sydney Jowers, Anaya Lewis, Dayani Massey, Sanaya Wardlaw, and Nevaeh Woodards. Congratulations, girls. I know you would have won the championship. This year, we decided to offer a new award 
It's the first time that this award has ever been given in the history of C.W. Henry. The name of this award is Student Athlete Leaders. I chose four young women who played multiple sports in sixth, seventh, and eighth grade while maintaining their grades and showing leadership qualities on and off the playing field and court. Congratulations to the following young women who I know will take their leadership qualities they've demonstrated in softball and volleyball and other sporting events into the world as they move forward. Morgan Gordy, Kyla Hall, Jocelyn Hayes, and Alea Crawford. Crawford. Congratulations, girls. I'm pleased to announce this Excellence in Social Studies Award. In class, this young woman was consistently outstanding. She was intellectually curious, asking meaningful questions and engaging in active listening. She completed quality work and she always moved the conversation forward, especially when discussing challenging topics. The 2020 Excellence in Social Studies Award goes to Morgan Gordy. Congratulations, Morgan. Hello everyone, my name is Peg Harley. I'm the upper school science teacher. I'm here to present some of the academic awards. The Michael Terman Alumnus Award for Most Improved Student in Reading. There's two of them and they're going to Azalea Melton Kelly and Timey Coyle. The Excellence in Reading Award goes to Kenneth Langston Payne. The Excellence in Writing Award. There's two awards for this also. Nevaeh Woodards and Morgan Jones. Excellence in Math Award goes to Anaya Lewis, and the Excellence in Science Award goes to Kyla Hall. Congratulations, graduates. Congratulations to the class of 2020. I'm Ms. Miller, and I am excited to present the following awards. The Excellence in Art Award goes to Majir Fleming. The Excellence in Musical Theater Award goes to Alea Crawford. The Excellence in Music Award goes to Faruza Hyman, and the Excellence in Athletics Award goes to Sincere Northern. Congratulations to you all. Congratulations to the eighth grade class of 2020. This is Mrs. Rapp, and I'm here to present several awards. The first award is the Schoolman's Club Award. Each year, students are chosen to receive the Schoolman's Club Award for service to the school, demonstrating leadership qualities, and overall academic excellence. This year, I am proud to present the Schoolman's Club Award to Dayani Massey. I am also pleased to present the Frank Sullivan PFT Human Relations Award. This award is presented on behalf of the Philadelphia Federation of Teachers Union every year to a student due to their good human relations that has been exemplified in the school. I am proud to present this year's Frank Sullivan PFT Human Relations Award to a young woman who has demonstrated the best of what it means to be human, Olivia Williams. Finally, I am presenting the Mr. and Miss Henry Award. We have five rules at Henry. Be respectful, be responsible, be peaceful and caring, be a problem solver and be a learner. Every year we award a male and female student the honor of representing our school as Mr. and Mrs. Henry students who exemplify the principles and values of our school. Because at Henry, we not only follow the five rules, we employ the ideas of compassion, honesty, generosity, service, respect, responsibility, acceptance, and leadership. This year, I am proud to present the award of Mr. and Ms. Henry to Sydney Jowers and Jaden Fuller. Thank you. Hello. I'm Mrs. Smith, and I'm excited to present the following awards to the class of 2020. The first award is for most improved students. We have the opportunity to award two students who have made great strides toward improvement in all areas of their academic life during their eighth grade year. This year, we would like to recognize Katina Dorsey and Jeremy Hayes. For perfect attendance, the following students have been in school on time each and every school day during the 2019-2020 school year. Sydney Jowers and Courtney Scott. 
For distinguished attendance, the following students have been in school each and every school day of the 2019-2020 school year. Anthony Emerson, Morgan Gordy, and Anaya Lewis. For meritorious honors, the following students earned A's and B's throughout their entire eighth grade year in every subject. April Augustine, Kylie Carter, Amara Chiaka, Chloe Coleman Palmer, Alea Crawford, Majira Fleming, Morgan Gordy, Sydney Jowers, Anaya Lewis, Georgia Webb, and Olivia Williams. And for distinguished honors, the following student earned all A's throughout her entire eighth grade year in every subject, Kyla Hall. Thank you. The Dorothy Caldwell Memorial Award is a special honor given annually in memory of a respected Henry School principal. This award is given to a student for excellence in all academic areas, for dependability and maturity, for social awareness and good citizenship, and for contributions to all aspects of school life. This year, I am pleased to present the 2020 Dorothy Caldwell Memorial Award to Kyla Hall. Hello, parents, teachers, graduates, of course, the rest of the family, the family pets. My name is Firuza Hyman, but you may know me as Roo, Roos, Roo Roo, Roos Roos, or Fairy. I had no idea what a farewell address was. I thought it was a place where people got together to say bye. So Ms. Rout sent me this great link. It gave me the directions to use to write a farewell address. Step one, greet the audience. Hello. Step two, tell them your name. I couldn't decide which one, so I decided to tell you all of them. Step three, reflect on your time in middle school. But if you know me, I rarely follow directions thoroughly. So I was going to break them at some point. I'm not just gonna reflect on our time in middle school, but also all of our years at Henry. Remember our first day of kindergarten or your first day at Henry? How about when we were finally old enough to go to Carnival by ourselves? That was really fun. Remember No Place for Hate? Remember that horrible song we used to love, Open Gangnam Style? What were we thinking? Do you remember our first day of middle school? How exciting that was? How about the time when we went to the zoo on Halloween? That was super cool. Do you remember the sad moments too? Like saying goodbye to Miss Rogers and now finally saying goodbye to each other? I would like to say thank you to all of my teachers throughout the years. And I want to give a special shout out to Miss Malika. Because even though she was only supposed to help even though she was only supposed to be helping me, I think we can say she helped each and every one of us when we needed it. I want to say thank you to Miss Canarini. Even though she acts like we're already in college, it was for the best. If I'm successful in school, it's more likely because Miss Canarini pushed me. And not that I was struck by lightning and suddenly became a genius. But what do I know? It might happen. I want to say thank you to Miss Rout because she taught us how to look at a piece of writing with a whole nother viewpoint. I want to give a shout out to Miss Smith because of her straightforward, organized way of teaching helps math make sense. I want to say thank you to Miss Harley for putting up with us through the years as a reading teacher and a science teacher. That was pretty amazing. I would also like to say thank you to Miss Gething and Miss Brissome, the special support teachers because they have helped me a lot in school and many others. I want to say thank you to Miss Worship. She helps students see and feel what book lovers feel when they read in class. I would keep going through every teacher and individual person that has been a part of my life throughout my years at Henry, but I have limited time. I have to fit all of our time at Henry, all nine years in about five to seven minutes. So thank you to all the teachers, the support, support staff, at Henry, the students, past and present, that made Henry what it is. Don't forget, Henry, this is where it all started. Even though this was a crazy year and people kept saying that annoying phrase, hashtag apart together, we're still graduating and it's okay. We had tons of great memories from Henry and we have a lot to look forward to. For my last piece of advice, I'm going to tell you a story. In the winter, I usually have a cold. And you know, when people have a cold, they usually sniffle. 
I don't do that. I have to snort. My mom get, got so annoyed one day and said, there's this great new invention called a tissue. Use it. And I'm just telling you this because you're grown up now. Don't use your sleeve. Use a tissue. Thank you. Hi, C.W. Henry. This is Miss Rogers. I am humbled, honored, and privileged to have the opportunity to say congratulations to the class of 2020. Whether you started Henry School in the kindergarten and you are a lifer, or you started Henry School this year, congratulations to you. You are leaving elementary school and ready to venture into high school. The next four years of your life are going to present you with some successes and some challenges. I want you to make sure that each and every day you enter into that high school with an open mind knowing that you can and will be successful. I have three tips for you. Pick and choose your friends wisely. Do your best in everything that you do and make sure you get involved. Get involved in as many activities as possible. Make sure that you make a positive name for yourself at high school. And now I leave you with this. We may live in an age of instant messaging, instant gratification, and Instagram. But there is no way to short circuit the path to success. Tori Birch. Be respectful, be responsible, be peaceful and caring, be a problem solver, be a learner, and you will have a phenomenal time at high school. Have a great day, everyone. Congratulations, eighth grade, from graduating from Charles W. Henry School. Some of you had the pleasure of teaching in fourth grade and I will remember all the fun times we had. To all eighth graders, it's been amazing to watch you grow into young adults and I cannot wait to see what you do in the future. Best of luck and come back and visit. Congratulations. Hello, CW Henry, eighth graders. I wanna take a moment to say congratulations on successfully completing your middle school experience here with us. Uh, it's been a real pleasure working with you for the last four years. Uh, I know this is not how most of you imagined uh, ending this chapter in your life, uh, but know that there are bigger and better things waiting for you on your next step. Uh, and hopefully you'll be able to look back and reflect upon this experience uh, and learn from it uh, and be better because of it. Uh, I can't wait to see what you guys do and become and discover into high school and beyond. I know you put a lot of effort into finding that right fit for yourselves for the next four years and hopefully you can continue that journey successfully as you think about uh, future careers, majors, professions, et cetera, as you go on. Please know that my door is always open and you're welcome to reach out at any time and I'd be happy to assist any way I can. Uh, beyond that, please enjoy this time, celebrate your family, uh, thank them for all their support and hard work uh, because they too helped you get to this point, uh, but you will be heading on to bigger and better things, as I said, uh, and we all can't wait to see what that is. Uh, congratulations, best of luck. Please take some time and enjoy this summer, uh, and go Hawks. Hello, eighth grade class of 2020. This is Mr. Jacobs here to wish you a very warm congratulations on move up day. I wish you the best of luck, and it has been so nice getting to know all of you during your stay at Henry. Congratulations to the class of 2020. I wish this could have happened at a happier time for uh, you and everybody, but you just should know that you are loved and you will be missed very much at CW Henry. You deserve to see your dreams come true. So remember, when you leave us, work towards your goals and stay focused on what you want to have happen. Congratulations today and best wishes, wishes for many wonderful tomorrows. Congratulations to the class of 2020. You guys did it, you rock. I just wanted to say congratulations. 
I wish you the very best. I may have had the privilege of teaching a few of you. I have may have had the privilege of seeing you in a hall, saying hello. All I wanted to say now is congratulations, do your best, give your best, and continue to be your best. Congratulations and welcome to your new journey. Hey, this is Mr. Munter. I just wanted to wish the class of 2020 Congratulations. It's uh, sad that we can't be together to celebrate in person, but hopefully it's a learning experience for you all. I wish you the best of luck in the future, and don't tell anyone about my mustache. Guys, this is Mr. Watts. I want to say congratulations to the class of 2020. I know you didn't expect for the school year to end like this, but stay focused on your goals and dreams. Enjoy your summer. Stay safe. Good luck in your new beginnings in high school, guys. Hi, class of 2020. It's me, Mrs. Worship. Webster's Dictionary defines greatness as the quality of being great or distinguished, and while that very well may be true, it's not entirely accurate in your case. Your personal greatness is defined because each and every one of you is great in some way. Your individual greatness seeps out of your fingertips from the tops of the hairs on your head and from the tips of the toes on your feet. I hope you continue to always push yourselves towards greatness, knowing that you can do, be, accomplish, inspire, and create anything you wish in this world. Congrats on all the amazing things you've accomplished so far, including graduating eighth grade. Woohoo! Always upwards and onwards in greatness. Congrats, guys. Congratulations, eighth graders. This is not the end of your academic career. It's just the beginning. I know you've already traveled a long way. I know that this is not how you wanted your eighth grade to end. You have lots of memories from your years at CW Henry, and you have a lot to look forward to. Congratulations and good luck in your future. Hello, I just wanted to say congratulations to the eighth grade class at Charles W. Henry Elementary School. I'm really bummed that we did not get to spend the last few months of school together, but I wanted to let you know how proud I am of all of you for the hard work that you have done in your years at Charles W. Henry. Please have a safe and relaxing summer, but better yet, have a wonderful time in ninth grade. Hello everyone, I'm Mrs. Smith and I'm here to wish C.W. Henry's class of 2020 best of luck in all you do. Hi guys, just wanted to take this opportunity to wish you congratulations and good luck in high school. You are the last class that I taught science to who will be graduating from C.W. Henry and that makes this a little bittersweet for me. Hope that you enjoy high school and please come back and see us. Congratulations to all of the eighth graders on your graduation. It's time to celebrate all of your hard work throughout the years, and I wanna wish you the best of luck as you move on from CW Henry into high school. Hi, class of 2020. Just wanna wish you a congratulations. You are on to bigger and better things. Hi, kids. This video will not be long enough to tell you everything that I have to say. But I do want to tell you how proud I am of you and what a privilege and an honor it has been teaching you and getting to know you over the last five and a half years and that you have made me a better teacher and a better person and that I am very grateful. I will miss you, but I'm very excited for you. Congratulations. Hi, Henry 8th graders, it's Ms. Schechter. I just wanted to send you a message, sending you love and congratulations on your graduation from 8th grade. Times are crazy, but we all um, are super proud of you and we're excited to see what you do in high school and beyond. Congratulations again. Hey guys, it's Ms. Steph, wishing you many blessings as you move forward on your journey. I'm really gonna miss you guys in the lunchroom, out in the yard, and especially every week during transpass time when you don't know how to get into alphabetical order. I want you to keep your head up to the sky and strive for everything that you want to achieve in life. I love you guys and I'm gonna miss you. Many blessings to you. Hi Amira, it's Mrs. Chapin. Just wanted to let you know it was a pleasure to work with you. And I wish you all the best and much success in your high school. 
endeavor. Um, please keep in touch with me. Good luck, honey. Congratulations, CW Henry Class of 2020. Miss Sydney here wishing you guys nothing but the best as you guys start your four-year journey of high school. I am so happy and proud of each and every one of you guys. It was a pleasure getting to know you guys over the last year, two years, three plus years. It was amazing. Um, I don't even know where to begin. You guys have taught me so much, so, so much. Um, you guys have always kept me laughing, kept me on my toes, and I am going to miss each and every one of you. I wish you guys, again, nothing but the best in high school, and as always, stay kind, caring, humble, and just love yourselves. Love how far you came in life. You guys did it. You guys are at the finish line of elementary school. Congratulations. As always, love, Miss Sydney. Congratulations for pushing through. Stay strong and good luck in high school. Congratulations, eighth grade. I'm so proud of all of you. Best of luck next year in high school. Hi, eighth grade. Congratulations. This is so exciting. I'm so happy for you. I know that this year, the way it turned out, is not what we were planning on, but we are proud of you. We love you. We support you. And we are so excited for you. And I know that you guys are going to do beautiful things in this world. Come back and visit. We'll miss you. You got this. Bye. Hey, New Jersey family. We just want to say congratulations. You're a graduate. Classy, bougie, graduate. Sassy, shining, dazzling. Okay. Acting, silly, what's happening? What's happening? You're a graduate. That's happening. Congratulations! Congratulations, Woo! Congratulations Kyla. Chloe, right? Chloe! 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 I just want to say, daughter, I love you so much, and congratulations. I'm so proud of you. Go. Congratulations, congratulations. from my son, and love you too, sis. Congratulations, Chloe. We love you. Congratulations, congratulations on your graduation, Joshua. This is from dad and mom. We're very proud of you, and we're going to see you go from middle school and to high school and to college and really blossom into a strong black man. God bless you, Joshua, from mom and dad. You are going to go into this world and set it on fire. God bless you. You are the next generation. Take it from here. Do it, black man. We love you always. Love always. Joshua, love always, dad. And mom. Mwah. God bless. God bless. Joshua, Uncle Free, I just want to say congratulations on your graduation in the eighth grade. You deserve it. I've watched you grow from an infant to a young man, and I watched you grow from a young man to a grown man. I love you dearly. You know, I'm always here for you. Congratulations to all your friends. Enjoy your graduation. Uncle Free, Joshua. Congratulations to the entire class of 2020. 2020. With a special shout out to Joshua. Joshua, my man, congratulations. You made it, man. You got four more years, boy. Four <laughs> more years, you know what I mean? <laughs> Very proud of you, young king. There's no limitations. Soar. To the top, man, like you always going to do, man. You're the best, man.
missing or your well-deserved success, Joshua. I wish your future will be colorful and beautiful. Congratulations on your next adventure. Love you always. Auntie Chinaki. Congratulations, Joshua. I am so proud of you. I love you so much, little brother. I know you're going to do such great things in high school. Keep up the good work and have faith. You got it. I love you. All right. See you later. This message is to my nephew, Joshua Weaver. Congratulations on completing the eighth grade. Good job, good job, good job, good job. G O O D J O B. Good job, good job. Keep up the great work and look at high school. Here come a real scholar. Congratulations, nephew. I love you. I wanted to congratulate my daughter, Faruza Hyman, on graduating the eighth grade from C.W. Henry. I hope she knows that everyone in the family is so proud of all the hard work that she did, including the cats. And congratulations on getting into the high school that you've been dreaming of going to since you were little. We love you, and we are very proud of you. This shout out is for Elijah Stevenson. We're so happy you're graduating from C.W. Henry and we wish you the best as you enter into your new journey in high school. Congratulations, Elijah. You're about to enter into high school, wishing you all the best. Butterscotch and Butterflies, Glam Mommy Angie. Congratulations, Sydney Jowers, on achieving academic success, perfect attendance, as well as getting to select it uh, to the high school of your choice. Wishing you all the best in your future four years. I know you will do great things. We love you and wish you all the best. Congratulations. Congratulations, baby girl. Deani, we are so proud of you. We can't wait to see you bloom into the little princess flower that you are at your new high school, Little Flower. We appreciate all the faculty and staff at C.W. Henry that helped you out throughout the years, starting with uh, kindergarten all the way up to eighth grade. And we just want to say we love you. Love Dad. you. I love you. And I love you. <laughs> Be good. And congratulations. Courtney Scott, 2020, eighth grade graduate, my granddaughter. This year has started out like none other you've seen. This pandemic landed in the middle of your birthday and all of your graduation activities. You have taken it in stride, and I am very proud of you. Congratulations, year 2020 graduate. My mom loves you. Go. Congratulations. Hi, I'm Natasha, my dearest mom. Just want to say thank you to the teachers and students at C.W. Henry for making this an amazing experience for my year. To the teachers, thank you so much for pushing him to be the best that he can be. To the students, thank you so much for making great memories with my year. To the kid, congratulations. I'm so, 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 so proud of you. I can't express it enough. From bringing home amazing grades to staying focused and consistent with your work, I tell you to continue dreaming, to continue being the best that you can be, and continue to work hard. I'm so, so, so proud of you. And to the class of 2020, congratulations, you guys. Congratulations, congratulations Courtney. Courtney. Congratulations to our graduate, Courtney, 2020. 2020. Woo! You did it. We love you. We, we love, love you, Courtney. Love you, Courtney. Love you. Courtney. Love you. You did it. Congratulations, Cash. You finish middle school, you go up to high school, and just keep doing you. I love you, little bro. Joshua, congratulations on your graduation, and I'll see you later. Hey, Joshua. Congratulations on graduating from the eighth grade. We love you. Peace out. I congratulate my sister, Deani Massey, for going to high school. You know, she's getting on my nerves, but I love her. I already know what you're going on prom with junior year and senior year. So, you know, you will always be my stance. Love you.
congratulations, Courtney. You've been a shining star since day one. And I know in going forward, you'll do the same. You're leaving grade school and you're going to high school now and then off to college. We're very proud of you. And we love you, nannies. Can't call you nannies anymore because you're growing up. Okay, pumpkin. Congratulations. Congratulations. Love you. Love you. That's it. That's a wrap. That's a wrap. Congratulations to my only granddaughter and first grandchild on her awesome accomplishments. I pray that this is just the beginning of the successes that you will experience. I am so proud of you, and I love you so much, Kyla Hall. My mom loves you. Congratulations, shout out. It's for my daughter, Kyla Hall. Prayers and blessings on your graduation and for your future. You are a shining star. Today will only be the first of many proud, successful moments for you. You have put in the hard work and have learned and grown so much. Always remember there's no limit to what you can do if you believe in yourself. I pray that you continue to grow and add to the goodness and beauty in the world. Congratulations. Love always. Mom, Dad, Brandon. Parkway Center City Middle College. Look out. Kyla Hall's on her way. Hey, Chloe. Congratulations. We're so proud of you. Love, Love you. you. Congratulations, Cassius. Congratulations, Cassius. We're so proud of you. Way to go, man. Have a great day. This is Aunt Lisa and Uncle Reggie. We love you. Take care. Congratulations, Jay, for graduating C.W. Henry Elementary School. I hope you do well in high school. Congratulations, and that I'm so, so, so proud of you. You did it, kid. It's almost over. I know this is what you had planned, but you know, everything in due time. I can't wait to see you. Can't wait to love up on you. Have a great day. Kyla, I'm so proud of you, pretty girl. Congratulations on your graduation, and the best is yet to come. I love you. Hey, Yaya, it's on Poodles. I'm calling to say congratulations, you did it. You have worked hard all year long. You stood each and every test, passed the test, and I again want to say congratulations. Continue to work hard and give it all you got. You go girl. Kyla, congratulations, we're so happy for you. You made it through the end of the school year and you worked just so hard getting there. All your hard work is going to pay off really soon, and now you get to have fun this summer. I love you, and I can't wait to see you succeed in life. And congratulations again on graduating. You deserve everything. Love you. Dot, congratulations. I love you. I love you. Love you. Congratulations, Congratulations, Sincere. Congratulations, Sincere. Congratulations, Sincere. High school, here you come. Congratulations. Congratulations, Sincere. Good Congratulations. Luck. We love you, Sincere. Congratulations, Sincere. Congratulations, Sincere. We're proud of you. We're proud of you. Love you. Thank you. That's my gosh here. Congratulations, Sincere. Congratulations, Sincere. Congratulations, Sincere. We love you. Congratulations. Congratulations, Sincere. Wish you the best. You suck. Dad. I love you. Congratulations. Congratulations, son. Keep shooting for the stars. I love you. Congratulations, Cash. We're so excited for you and we're proud of you. 
you're finally done with eighth grade. It was a long journey, but you're done, and we're so excited for your high school career. Congrats, Cash. We love you. We love you, Cash, and congratulations to the class of 2020. We're so excited for you guys. Yay. Congratulations. All right, Joshua, you got to the eighth grade. Eight years down, four more to go. I'm proud of you. Keep it up. Joshua, um, Nkrumah, of course, you know who I am, Nkrumah Sekou Jennings. Um, very proud of you, brother. You already know that. Always proud of you. Um, it's been a very exciting time. Of course, I wish that we could uh, do it the regular way we've been doing it, but I'm glad to do this here. So congratulations. I'll be there on that day to witness, and you know I love you. Hi, Kyla. Congratulations on your graduation. I'm so proud of you. You are such a bright star and you're going to go so far. And I'm always here for you. I love you so much and I miss you and I'm so proud of you. Yay. Graduation, Cassius. Your great grandmama is so proud of you. Hey, Cash. Congratulations. I'm so proud of you, and I know that you're gonna do well. And I know you know how to feel now, and you're gonna do an outstanding job there in high school. So proud of you, and I'm looking forward to seeing you. Love you. I'd like to take this time to congratulate my granddaughter Morgan Brianna Gordy on her graduation from C.W. Henry School. She's graduating from the eighth grade. Mimi J is so excited. Um, she'll be attending Parkway Center City Middle College in September, where the graduates leave the school with a high school diploma as well as an associate's degree. They partner with Community College of Philadelphia. Morgan wants to be an OBGYN physician, and I am so proud of her. Congratulations again, and I love you. We are part of the proud village of Jeff Jeff, and we want to say congratulations! Hi, I'm Siani. I'm Majira's aunt, and first I want to congratulate the entire class for such a huge accomplishment, and especially Majira for working hard and still finding the time to express his talents. I love you and keep reaching your goals. Congratulations, Ken. Congratulations, Shania. You made it to eighth grade. You've been going to CW Henry School since you was kindergarten. That means you're a lifer. Congratulations. I know you're going to do awesome at Parkway, and I love you, and the sky's the limit. Congratulations, Jaden. We're, We're proud, proud of you, and we love you. Congratulations, Jaden. We love you. Love you. Love you. Class of 2020. Don't go to the window. <laughs> Don't go to the window. Oh, no, no, no. Hi, Kyla. It's Noni and Pop Pop. We want to congratulate you on your 2020 graduation. We know that things haven't been the way that you expected them to be, but we want to let you know we love you so much, sweetheart, and we're so proud of all the things that you've done. Congratulations and happiness for you in your new endeavors. Go. Congratulations! Congratulations, Naya. Oh, moving on to high school. We are so proud of you. Congrats, Naya. Love we you. love you. Hey, Sanaya, we wanted to say congratulations. We're really proud of you. You did an awesome job in school this year. Unfortunately, you know, we all had some trying times toward the end, but you persevered. So congratulations and good luck in high school. We love you. Congratulations, Sanaya. Congratulations. 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 Get ready to set the world on fire. We love you. Bye-bye. Congratulations, class of 2020. 
Class of 2020, congratulations. What can I say? Congratulations. Wishing you all the best. Got an exciting, exciting future ahead of you. <laughs> Y'all never forget this 2020 coronavirus and video graduations. I know. From kindergarten to eighth grade, you made it. You stuck it out. And moving on, moving forward. We love you. Thank you to my homeroom teacher, to my brother's homeroom teacher. Thank you for all the teachers, actually, to help me and my family get through this situation to help me graduate this year. I want to say congratulations to the class of 2020 and my classmates for, well, everything that we've done together. And, yeah. Congratulations, Kyla. Big Cousin is so proud of you. I just want to remind you of a couple of things. You are beautiful both inside and out. You are brilliant beyond measure. The world is yours, baby girl. Keep your eye on the prize. Keep your foot on their necks. And there's nothing you can't do. And I'm always in your corner. Love you and congratulations again. I want to congratulate all of my classmates and my teachers for helping us graduate. Hi, so I'm Jeremy and Jocelyn's mom, and I want to give a huge shout out to the teachers, the counselors, the principal, and everyone who's made this a wonderful experience for us. We are so sad to leave you guys, but excited to start the future. Congratulations. On behalf of the Seward family, I wanted to say I'm so proud of my son, Scott Seward. I'm so proud of all the work that you've done and that you will continue to do. I know you're going to be amazing in your life's journey. So, congratulations. I'm proud of you, bro. Congratulations. Congratulations, congratulations Katina. Katina. We're, We're so proud of you. And a shout out to Janai Jones. Congratulations to you, woo, baby. Woo, woo. We are so proud of you and to the rest of the class of 2020. You guys rock. Congratulations, y'all. Yeah. We're proud of you. Guess what? You're graduating going to the ninth grade. Isn't that awesome? And I just want to give you a shout out for congratulations on your 8th grade graduation going to the high school, ninth grade. Congratulations. Love you always. Yeah, congratulate you saying I'm leaving the high school the same year you're going in. Isn't that nice? Congratulations, Kyla. Aunt Chubby loves you. Going to high school. Congratulations, my great-granddaughter. This is my mom. Oh, I'm so proud of you. Lots of love and congratulations and good health and wealth. Love you. Congratulations, Kyla. Hey, Miss Kyla Hall, a.k.a. Rebecca. It's your Aunt Tierra. And I just want to say congratulations on graduating from the eighth grade. I'm so proud of you as you enter this new step and getting ready, you know, to go to high school. I know it's an exciting time and I'm so proud of you. I love you. And if you ever need anything, you know, you can always come and talk to me and congratulations you know class 2020 whoop, whoop. and yeah happy graduate hey Scotty it's your uncle T.I. and I just want to take some time to let you know like I try to tell you every time I have the opportunity how proud I am of you you just make my spirit fly and you know that I know that the next several years are gonna be ones where you have to work hard. I love you, I'm proud of you, and I know you're gonna be a big, big man because you're a wonderful young man. <laughs> Yo, congratulations. I'm in your room doing TikTok <laughs> videos. Congratulations, I'm proud of you. Uh... <laughs> congratulations, my dear. We're so proud of you. Congratulations, and I love you, brother. Yeah, when you see me on TikTok doing the pop lock, you be all right. Congratulations, Ma. I'm proud of you. Love you, my mom. Congratulations, Ma. I'm proud of you. I love you, and I want you to continue doing what you're doing in school and continue chasing your dreams. Love, I'm You always do your best in school and in everything you do. A nephew is a gift from Jehovah God in a world that changes fast. 
you have a specialness inside of you that I know will always last. Romans 10, 11 says, For the scripture says, No one who rests his faith on Jehovah will be disappointed. Love you much. Continue to grow and do your best. Love on Barbara. Jaden, mommy loves you so much. I just want to say I'm so very, very proud of you. Only way to go from here is up. High school, here we come. Class of 2020. Love you, son. I love you, big. I love you, big brother. I know. I know you couldn't do regulations, so we decide we're gonna do one for you. Oh. Congratulations, Sanaya Ward Law, on your eighth grade graduation. Uh, here to support you in all your future endeavors. Good luck in high school, and I love you, baby. Don't be discouraged, you guys. Everyone's going through this together. The coronavirus is not stopping our show. Um, congratulations to the class of 2020. You guys made it from kindergarten to eighth grade. So now we love you. Great love job. You, high school, here they come. Good day, sir. This is uh, my year's second dad. Just want to say how proud I am of you, specifically in the class of 2020 and everything that we're going through right now. I wish you guys the best. Um, you made me very proud this year. We're home straight A's and B's all year. You know, we get the cap, we continue to do the same thing and the sky's the limit from there. Um, let's keep up the good work, sir. I love you. Congratulations, Boom. You are now a high schooler. I am so proud of you as your big cousin slash big cousin. Big sister, I've seen you work really hard to get them grades. I've got on you a couple times about getting to it, so I'm proud and hope you're going to get more and more success. God bless. Happy graduation, Joshua. I can't believe you're already graduating from eighth grade. I feel like it was just yesterday you were a baby and I was holding you in my arms. I hope you enjoy your special day. Bye from Atlanta. Hey, Courtney. Hey, Courtney. <laughs> we're here in the ATL and we, we're so proud. <laughs> We're so proud of you. We want to wish you uh, congratulations on going to your next step in your future. Go on to high school, baby. Congratulations, Courtney. Congratulations. 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 We're so proud of you. We love you. Hi, Scotty. Hi. 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 Congratulations. Congratulations to yeah. high school. Class of 2020. Woo! Woo! That's we, me. <laughs> <laughs> we hope you do well in your new high school and your new yes. adventures. Yep. We love you yeah, and congratulations. Don't yourself. forget what I said. No one's your friend. Mm -hmm. Stay to yourself. Love you back. Be safe and be educated. Yes. Love you. Bye. Bye-bye. Langston, I'm so proud of you as you go into the ninth grade at Science Leadership Academy. Remember 2 Timothy 1.7, God has not given us a spirit of fear and timidity, but of power, love, and self-discipline. I love you so much. Congratulations, congratulations, Langston, as you go into the ninth grade. And re always remember what Albert Einstein says and your daddy too. It's not that we're smarter than anybody, we just stay with the problems. Hi Jade, we wanted to congratulate you on your 8th grade graduation from C.W. Henry Elementary and continued success on to W.B. Saul Agricultural School. We know that you're going to succeed in whatever you do with your determination. We love you. Yes Jade, we know that you're bright, you're funny, smart, and you do whatever you set your mind to. So, <laughs> you'll be a big success. Love you. Congratulations, my dear, as this sister is really, it really makes me happy to see you happy and you able to go to the school that you want to go to. So congratulations on your graduation. Congratulations. Like, you, you surpassed, you passed us. Like, you're out of middle school. Like, you're in high school. Like, you're in the big league now. Good job. Hey, Courtney. This is a shout out from Aunt Dina and God's Little Flower Garden. We are so proud of you. You have been an excellent student all through school, and you were even an excellent student when you were here at daycare. So, Courtney, I want you to remember that you are beautiful, chosen, made for a purpose, a precious child of God, and you'll be loved forever. 
Congratulations, Courtney, on your graduation and the class, and the class of 2020 C.W. Henry School. Job well done. We love you. Good job. You and everyone in your class and all of your accomplishments, just understand that this is just a small step in your future. Continue to push forward. Never give up. And just take every moment as a learning lesson. When you're at home right now, if you feel like you're bored or stressed, take this time out to better yourself. Find out something that you're passionate about, that you're interested in, and excel in that. Learn it. Look it up. Google it. Use your time wisely. And never give up. It's not the sky is the limit for you. The universe is your playground. So continue to grow. Congratulations. I know it probably doesn't seem like it right now, but life has so many opportunities, and those opportunities are doors waiting and opening for you. Georgia, I need to tell you, I am so proud of you and everything that you do. I've watched you blossom into a beautiful young lady. I have prepared you for any and all of life's trials and tribulations. And you know we've been through a few of those, and you've handled it well. Today, I need you to stand up, be proud, and say that I can. I will do it. I will make purpose of my life. Thanks for making it. Possible. Congratulations, Faith. It's been a hard, rough year, but you made it. <laughs> <laughs> Look like you made it. Oh, right. I taught y'all. <laughs> Congratulations, Faith, on making it to the next level. Congratulations. Hey, Faith. Congratulations. Love you. Hey, young Faith the Great. Um, Congratulations on your graduation. It's a big move, big step. You know what I mean? Proud of you. Congratulations. Congratulations. Congratulations, Faith. Hi, my name is Michael Gordon. I want to give a shout out to my daughter, Nicole Gordon, for graduating from C.W. Henry. Whoa! And moving on to Girls High. That's what's up. My daughter, I love you. I'm proud of you. You worked hard. You earned it. You deserve it. And I'm thankful. I'm thankful for you just doing the best that you can be. And the main thing I want you to do, mamas, it's just focus, focus, focus. Set goals and focus. Don't look to the left or right. Just focus and be your very this best. This is Jamitra Gordon, a parent of Nicole Gordon, graduate of 2020, eighth grade. Congratulations, Nicole. We are so proud of you. Yay, you did it. woo -hoo! Yes. Girls High, here she comes. You got a bright star on your hands. She's going to do well. We're so proud of you, baby. Keep pushing forward. Keep pushing. Keep being you. Keep being awesome. Congratulations. Ninth grade, here we come. I got a high schooler. Yes! Woo! -hoo! Hey, girl. Congratulations. Uh, we so proud of you. Definitely so, so proud of you, everybody. And um, I know it's a rough, a rough graduation this year because it's different, but y'all one of a kind. Y'all one of a kind. So, Y'all gonna do great things. You're gonna do great things. So keep your head up and congratulations. And again, we're so proud of you. So, so proud of you. Congratulations, class of 2020. You made it. We are so proud of you. I hope you have the best summer and the best year. Congratulations. I love you. Cousin Tanaya. Bye. From the Powell family, Cousin Tanaya, you are the best. Don't let anything stop you. The world is your oyster. We're cheering you on. Love you.